I'm going to show you how to change something on your front page. Front page is a little bit different from your regular pages and posts. It's controlled by widgets and widget areas. And you think of them just little boxes that hold whatever you slide into them. Um, go to your dashboard. And you're going to want to go to widgets. And here down this side, I can see all the widgeted areas I have. The primary sidebar, if you have it set to show on pages, and so, this is where you control it. If you're using two sidebars, your secondary sidebar information would be here, but I'm not using that. And here's my home page. Right now, all I have on my home page, main part, is recent posts. I'm showing five categories, and you can see that here. It's showing five. I could go there and I could tell it to show seven or whatever I wanted to. This is where I can change. I can even change and tell it. I, I'm showing an excerpt. I could tell it to show limited content and show 400 characters. You can play around with it till you get the look that you want, but there's lots of settings in a widget area like this. Primary sidebar, this is where on my site, this is all of this. I'm actually have this added in the code, so we won't count that in the in the sidebar. But find me at all of this. You can see exactly this is it. This is the text bar that has all the code to show all my links that are here. This is a standard. These are widgets you can just you can slide in if you want to add something. Say I wanted to add in something about the new training videos. And I'm just going to slide in a text bar and I can type in whatever I want. And I could add in some links here. I'm going to save this just so you can see. Right now it'll go it'll go to the bottom because I slid it into the end. And I forgot I'm using super cache. If you're using super cache, I tend to keep that open in a tab. It's hard to see your changes because you're actually viewing the cached version. I just click delete cache. Now I'm going to refresh the page. And this is the text I just added. Now if I decide I don't like that, I want to take that out. I'm just going to slide it over here. If I wanted to keep it, because I might decide to put it back in, I'd slide it to this area. This is in active widgets, but it saves the settings. If you throw it here, it's like throwing it into the trash can. And footers, I am using a footer on mine, but I only wanted one section being used. These are all blank. There's actually four areas I could put something in. If I want it blank, I just slide an empty text, otherwise it shows some default text that you don't want showing. So this is the only one I'm actually using, and again, it's just the contact me, the email information. But this is how you control everything on the front, the front home page of your site, or the sidebars. And you, these are just all different little options, depending on what kind of plugins you have. Some plugins have their own widget areas. You just slide what you want in place and set the settings then go and see what it looks like if it's what you want then you're good to go